if you eat something and you know that it's going to defile you and make whatever medical condition you have, then for me, I'm not eating pork. Ask the pastor. Are Christians allowed to eat pork? <laughs> Are Christians allowed to eat pork? Yeah, you know, I, I think that there are certain things that gives the appearance of being spiritual. Mm. Um, and so given a certain amount of money or eating certain kind of foods or refraining from eating certain kind of foods sometimes can give the appearance um, that we are spiritual and that we're religious and so forth. Uh, but when I think about this question, I think about the Apostle Paul. Um, the Apostle Paul was extremely religious before he had an encounter with Christ. And uh, once he had this encounter with Christ, he had a, a fuller understanding of God's program. And he understand that a lot of things in the Old Testament are shadows and types, and they point to the reality which is found in Christ. And like uh, my brother just shared, I mean, the bigger issue is your relationship with the Lord. So the Apostle Paul tells us, he tells young Timothy, for example, that whatever food you receive in Thanksgiving, um, you consecrate it with a word of Thanksgiving, then it's clean. Um, he gets on Peter uh, because Peter is eating you know, maybe some ribs and pork chops with some Gentiles. <laughs> there you go. And um, then some Jews came and, and he decided to kind of scale back. Mm -hmm. And he helped them understand that, you know, it's um, uh, everyone that tries to live by the law uh, will be living under a curse, not because the law is bad, mm -hmm. but because the law brings to the surface um, the issues that we have. And like my brother pointed out, we have grace now. And so the bigger issue is, um, you know, how do we get right with God? And we get right with God not by refraining from eating pork or some other kind of food. Uh, we get right with God through Jesus Christ. And that's the emphasis that you see in the New Testament. Now, that being said, um, as my brother brought out, you know, uh, we still want to be wise. The body is the temple. Mm -hmm. uh, we want to be good stewards of what God has entrusted into us. Uh, and so we do want to be careful about what we put into our bodies, but it has nothing to do with whether it draws us closer to God or bring us further away from God. That's all dependent upon your relationship with Christ. Uh, but nonetheless, we want to be good stewards with the bodies that God has given us. See, the Muslims believe that you cannot eat pork. There are religions that believe that it's a sin to eat pork. So it's a very good question. So if this person would came back and they used to be a Muslim and they've got converted, that would be wonderful. It's a very good question. Um, and they answered it, well, we live under the law, but it's, it's wrong for me to eat pork. It's wrong for me to eat pork because I said this before and I got in trouble because I have high blood pressure and it takes my blood pressure up. Okay. And because, we, because we're not disciplining, you, the Bible that says, may the Lord God sanctify thy holy body, soul, and spirit. Mm. If you eat something and you know that it's going to defile you and make whatever medical condition you have, then for me, I'm not eating pork. I mean, mm. I don't eat it. I, it uh, ribs are good. I love bacon. But it takes my <laughs> blood pressure up, which can cause mm. others. So right. my answer to this is some people are allowed, but there's some people that aren't because of health reasons. Here's the problem, like what they said. When it becomes a law, mm -hmm. and you actually look at it as a law, separate you from God, that's where it's, you gotta have to be careful. Hey everyone, hope you enjoyed the video. To see more like this, be sure to hit the subscribe button below. Get all the latest content from TCT Ministries. We'd love to pray alongside you for God's blessings in your life. So you can email your prayer requests to prayer at tct.tv or click the link below and submit your request at tct.tv. God bless you and thank you for watching.